Hi, I'm your doctor today. So let me just take a look. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the nurse told me that you're here because you slipped, fell and hit your head. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So, first of all, what's your name? Mm -hmm. And do you know where we are? And what's today's date? Mm -hmm. Perfect. So, do you remember how this happened? Like, what you did right before you slipped? The accident itself? What happened afterwards and how you got here? Anything else happened? Okay. And how did you feel afterwards? Did you lose consciousness? Okay. Okay. Are you experiencing anything unusual at the moment? Like a headache, nausea, drowsiness? Okay. What about double vision or sensitivity to noise and light? Okay. Hmm. Okay. Anything else you want to tell me? To make sure you don't have a concussion, I would like to assess the function of your cranial nerves with some tests. Does that sound okay to you? Very good. So let me know if you experience any symptoms during the following tests, okay? Don't worry, it's only a few tests and none of them will hurt you in any way but depending on the results you may have to stay with us for the night okay so take a few deep breaths i'll just put on my gloves prepare some things and then we can get started okay Have you ever done this before? Okay. Well, don't worry. We'll get through this together. Okay. 
Let me take a look at your head first, especially the area where you hit it, okay? So, which side did you say it was again? Okay, I will look at that side first. I can't see any blood, but I'm going to touch your head now, all right? Is that okay? Okay, don't worry, I'll be careful. So, does this hurt? Okay, and this. Okay, and what about this? Okay. And does it hurt when I touch your head right here? Alright. Yeah. You have a pretty big bump right where you hit your head. I'm sure that hurts a lot. Did the nurse give you some ice earlier? Oh. <laughs> It's already melted while you were waiting for me. Well, no problem. I'll ask her to give you a new bag once we're done, okay? Okay, so let me just take another look. looks like you don't have any cuts anywhere. That's good. We will let you ice this more later to take care of the swelling and give you some painkillers, right? Okay. Are you allergic to anything? Okay, I'll just... Are you ready for the tests? <laughs> Good. So the first thing I noticed is that your speech isn't slurred and you seemed pretty oriented when I asked you the questions earlier. That's good. And now I'll start off the actual tests by yeah, testing your olfactory nerve. Hmm? Yeah, that's your sense of smell, exactly. So would you please cover your left nostril for me? And I will just hold this little bottle under your nose. Would you please tell me what it smells like? Yeah. Okay, thank you. So here we go. Again? Yeah, sure. Yeah, very good. <laughs> that was peppermint. That's right. Now, just cover your right nostril for me. And I will hold another one of these little bottles under your nose. Okay? Would you just tell me what the smell is again? Great, so here we go. <laughs> and again. Yeah, that's right, that was lemon, perfect. Next up 
is your optic nerve, which means we will test your eyes. So let me just grab something. We will test this with this chart. You've probably seen this before, right? So I will point at the row and you tell me the letters you can read in that row, okay? All right, let's start up here. Yeah, <laughs> that was easy, I know. What about this one? Mm -hmm. Yeah, very good. What about the ones down here? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, even if you're not 100% sure, just tell me what you think it is. Yeah, that sounds very good. And let's try this one down here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. Very good. So, have you ever done a color blindness test? No? Don't worry. Pretty similar to yeah, what we just did. Let me just grab the chart for that one. So that's this one. Okay. And I'll just put that. Yeah. So the chart for that one looks like this. And I will just hold it up like the one before. And would you please tell me if you can see a number inside of the circles and which one that is. We will go from left to right and we will start with this one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What about the ones down here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very good. Good job. Everything's looking great so far. And now I will be wiggling my fingers like this and would you just tell me which finger was moving? Yeah? Okay. Focus on my nose, please. Yeah? Very good. Very good. Next, I will be moving my fingers and please tell me when you can't see them anymore, okay? Eyes on my nose again. Mm -hmm. Now would you please just keep your head straight and follow my fingers with your eyes, okay? 
that straight, only moving your eyes. Very good. Thank you for that. So next I will be using this light right here to test the reactivity of your pupils. Okay, so let me just shine into this eye first. Okay, very good. So how are you feeling now? Still feeling fine? No double vision, dizziness or headaches? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. So the next one I'm going to test is your trigeminal nerve. It's involved in the sensory supply to your face and also the motor supply to the muscles that help you chew. Okay, so for this one I will be using this cotton swab and the end of this one. Okay, and I'll be lightly touching your face in some areas. So please close your eyes and tell me if and where you felt it and which one I used. Okay? Alright. Let's start. I'll be... Okay. Mm-hmm. That's right. one for that. 
don't be alarmed. <laughs> I know it sounds scary, but it'll be over really quickly and I promise it won't hurt, okay? So just keep your eyes open. Yeah. And the other side. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that was it, perfect. Now, for the next one, please just clench your teeth together, together while I touch your jaw and your temples, okay? Yeah, very good. And, uh, yeah, very good. Okay, let me get and now would you try to open your mouth while I lightly push against it? Yeah. Thank you. Could you try to swallow for me? Thank you. <laughs> now, crease up your forehead for me. Yeah, just like that. Okay. Thank you. Take some more notes really quick, okay? Just how to write some things down <laughs> after we did some tests. Okay, so. Just a few more. cheeks out like this yeah and now give me a smile and reveal your teeth yeah very good thank you I'll be putting my hands right here on your shoulders now could you just shrug them for me Okay, and now I'll apply some pressure on your cheek. Would you please try to move your head in this direction? Yeah, thank you. And we'll also do the other side, so... Once again, I'll put my hand right here and just try to move your head in that direction. Okay, very good. Now, I know it might seem rude, but please stick your tongue out for me. Like this. Yeah, thank you. I saved the worst one for last. <laughs> I have to lightly touch the back of your tongue with this cotton swab. Okay, I just have to test your gag reflex really quick. So just open your mouth, please. And I'll put this one right there. Well, it looks like 
you don't have a concussion. But I would still like to have you stay here overnight just for observation. Um, I want to make sure everything is okay. Yeah? So if nothing happens during the night and you continue to feel fine, you can go home tomorrow after another one of these <laughs> and a few other tests, okay? Would that be okay with you? Great. So, is there anything else you want to tell me or you want to ask? Okay. Well, I will let the nurse know you're staying the night. And she'll be here with some paperwork in a little while. I'll also tell her about the bag of ice you need for the bump on your head, alright? And, yeah, get some rest and we'll see each other tomorrow, okay? <laughs>